Uh, yeah, I'm Casey Kreider, uh, long snapper for the Denver Broncos. Right, mate. Well, um, what do you think of this? This is awesome. Um, you know, I was talking to some people, and I grew up, my dad played club rugby here in the States. Um, so when we were training in the offseason for high school football, we would play touch sevens. Um, and I've never seen rugby at this level, at, at this professional level. So I'm really excited to kind of see how it all works, how fast the game is, and just kind of like take the minimal knowledge I have and, and, and enjoyment I have of the sport and see it at a big level. You learning the rules pretty quickly? I, I'm, I'm learning. I just learned that there's kind of different levels of rugby. There's rugby league and rugby union. Um, so someone was kind of coaching me up on the different rules and um, kind of getting an understanding of the game so I can have a feel for what's going on tomorrow. Any tips for the players on how to deal with um, you know, kicking the ball at altitude? You know, Everyone says you're going to kick the ball further and higher, and it's true, you do. But it comes down just as fast as it goes up, so uh, so just be ready for that. I think there will be a couple. Um, we kind of fell right after our big off-season program. So a lot of guys take this time and get away. They go on vacation, kind of recharge your batteries for the season. What do you think of, like, um, the, generally in America, the... You know, for rugby league or rugby union, do you think they've got a future here? Do you think they can break into the market here? I really hope so. I mean, I think it's an awesome sport. I've always wanted to kind of get involved in it. Um, but kind of being on the track I have been to get to the NFL, it was kind of a risk-reward thing. Like, it would be a lot of fun. But if I got hurt playing it, it that wouldn't be smart for me. Um, but, but like I said, I think there's a lot of similarities to football, American football. Um, you know, I think from what I've heard from people with the concussion things, I think some people think rugby might be a safer sport just because it's based on technique tackling. Mm -hmm. um, and I think if, if if we can find a way to maybe intermix them, I think it would be awesome to see rugby blow up. And uh, I guess when new teammates walk into the dressing room, you size them up. How do you look at these guys and size them up? What do you think of them? It's crazy. There are some guys out here who are massive, and it's like, man, I would not want to be tackled by them. And then you see the little kind of the smaller, shorter guys. Um, and it compares to the NFL, you know, as a long snapper, uh, on a punt, I, I'm in charge of snapping the ball to the punter and then blocking bigger guys. Mm -hmm. And then when the ball gets kicked, it's it's now kind of part of my job to go tackle a smaller, faster guy. Um, and like I said, the similarities are there, but just the difference in the sport is going to be is going to be cool to watch. Do you think there's many athletes in the NFL that could go nonstop for 80 minutes? <laughs> I would. I'm, I'm going to say no. <laughs> I know. Uh, I know. Even if I have to run a couple sprints, it's kind of like, man, I really don't want to do that. I couldn't imagine running for 80 minutes straight. <laughs> And is it just the no pants, no helmet thing that always blows you guys away? I think it is. I think, uh, you know, even kind of through, we watch hit, hit clips where, you know, you're seeing big collisions kind of get guys juiced up. And a lot of them are rugby and, and kind of Australian football clips of these guys without pads on running into each other at high speeds. It, it, being from a sport where I wear pads and get hit at high speeds, I, I, I wouldn't want to get hit without pads. I feel there's reasonable awareness that this, this event song will get a reasonable crowd tomorrow? I really hope so. Like I said, you know, I've, I've, I have a general knowledge of rugby, and when I heard it was coming, I was super excited to, to show up and, and watch it. Um, so I really hope it, there's a good turnout because this is such a cool event. It's, it's high level. Um, I know there used to be kind of a, a professional American rugby team here. I don't know if they're still going. I think last year they weren't around. So I hopefully it can rejuvenate the sport. I think the more sports we have here, the better.